The Mississippi State Bulldogs hosted their in-state rival Ole Miss Thanksgiving night during the Egg Bowl. The Rebels and the Dogs met for the 110th Egg Bowl on a cold, foggy night at Scott Field. A key play was in the first half when Bo Wallace's pass was picked off by senior free safety Nico Whitley. The Dogs couldn't get any points out of the turnover and Andrew Ritter missed a field goal in the first quarter that kept the score tied at zero. Ole Miss won the toss and went on defense first, but the Bulldogs were able to score on a two-yard touchdown by Dak Prescott. The Bulldogs finished the regular season at 6-6, six and six, and they will head to their fourth consecutive bowl game. For more information on tickets, visit hellstate.com. Mudslingers is a family-owned ATV park nestled in the Kilgore Hills of Clay County, Mississippi, about eight miles east of Houston. The park opened in March of 2013 and offers over 700 acres, including 250 yards of mud pits and a five-acre lake for riders of all ages. The Lady Bulldogs went to Naples, Florida for the first annual Gulf Coast Showcase Tournament. Maroon and White started off great, defeating Grand Canyon 71-62. I'm Katie Lynn Wright, and I'm joined by Longest Student Health Center dietitian Mandy Conrad, who has been teaching MSU students, faculty, and staff how to take better care of their bodies. Okay, with exams comes a lot of stress. Mm -hmm. What implications could that stress cause, and how can students avoid it? According to Disney, New episodes of the Star Wars saga will be released starting in 2015, hoping to capture the hearts of new generations. Now the question is, what do Star Wars fans think about this? Sunday, the Detroit Red Wings defeated the Buffalo Sabres 3-1, which put Buffalo at their fourth straight loss of the season. Detroit improved their record to 7-3-1 on the road, while the Sabres remained winless since November 15th. Failed conversions were costly to Buffalo in their two chances. The Sabres have lost 11 of 13 home games. That's all for Take 30 Sports. Coming up next, James Lowe has information on how the color red can help you knock off a few pounds.